Rest room, I need a band aid. I heard a Pokemon was stolen you. I was just getting some information from Professor Elm. Apparently, it was a young male with long red hair. Hmm. What? You battled a trainer like that? Did you have it against his name? Yes, I did. I knew his eyes had a sense of silver in them. So I'm gonna call him Silver. That drawing does have pretty eyes. Yeah. His eyes are really pretty. But he's kind of mean, though. Okay, so Silver was his name. Then you were helping in my investigation. Hell, this is terrible. Oh, yes. What was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? This. What's the Pokemon egg? If it is, it's a great discovery. What? Professor Oak gave him a Pokedex. Ally, that's true. That, that, that's incredible. He has the purpose of seeing the potential of people as trainers. Well, Ally, you may have what it takes to become a champion. You seem to get on great with Pokemon, too. You should take the Pokemon Gym Challenge. What? The closest gym will be the one in Violet City. Okay. Ally, the road to the championship will be a long one. Before you leave, make sure you talk to your mom. Nobody talks to people anymore. We'll just call her. Oh, I know. I can have a very cool one here. <sighs> Alright. Well, let's get this over with. Ella, you received on your Pokedex quest. Thank you. Thank you for the Pokeballs. Sweet. Keep Pokemon, where'd you get it? So you're leaving for an adventure. Okay, I'll have to. But what can I do for you? I know, I'll save money for you. No. You know, it's a team. Now go on. Alright. You have the option to save your money, but I don't really want to do it because usually your mom just buys useless items. I've seen you a couple times. How many Pokemon have you got? Would you like to show you a catch Pokemon? Alright. One last thing I had to explain. This guy is a bunny back sprite. Dude. <laughs> That's how you do it. You're weak and the first Pokemon are easier to catch. Alright, so you know the drill. Lower Pokemon's HP, give it a status ailment, then throw a Pokeball. That's how it works. As you can see, it's morning. I had to pretty much turn my game off earlier. I didn't really turn the game off, I just put it somewhere in, but in the charger. Time passes in this game, so right now it's early morning. There's also a night cycle, too. So it's clearly past midnight, so that means there'll be more berries in the trees. Yay! Hey, it's a berry! Hooray! Yes. 
Heal them up, please. Thank you. Thank you, Nurse Joy. Now, you heard Professor Elm say we have to go to Violet City now. But to start off, I'm gonna buy some Pokeballs. There we go. Some antidotes. Some paralyzed heals. And some awakenings. There we go. You never know when something's gonna happen. So you always best to go out prepared. So in order to get the Violet City, you have to go this way. Now you could have gone over here earlier, but it would have been blocked by the path by two trainers owning a rat and a Pidgey. I had just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. No, wait, no, me. Come on, let's battle. Hey, Joey. And your top percentage red attack. How you doing? How's that for a top percentage red? <laughs> uh, I don't have any more Pokemon. Then you should have gotten more. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? Then you have to battle. Okay. When you got like some sort of Pidgey or something. Mikey. Oh wow, you do. Oh well, I'll scratch it. <laughs> Clearly you fail at whipping your tail. That is a rhyme. Mikey! Strange, I won before. Well, clearly you win because you have two Pokemon, whereas Youngster Joey only had one. Oh, it's a Weedle. Weedle's a good Pokemon if you really want to use them. Of course, I would usually recommend Caterpie over Weedle. Mostly because Speedrill doesn't really have much qualities going for him. Aside from poisoning everything. But if you want to use Weedle, by all means, use Weedle. Oh, you're not a trainer. You look like a trainer, though. Are you a trainer? Uh, you look too young to be a trainer. Alright, we'll keep going. No, we can't cut trees yet. I forgot. Bell sprouts. Bell sprouts a grass type Pokemon. You can pretty much catch him if you're not using Chikorita. Those Vine Whip. So that's interesting. Not really the best Pokemon to be training off of if you have Totodile like I do. If you have Cyndaquil on the other hand, it's pretty much the best time you'll have training your fire type. I found an antidote! Yay! Okay. So here we have the uh, dark cave over here. I'm gonna try to make my way up to that item over there. <sighs> well, I don't have water gun yet, so I might have to run from this thing. Alright, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go, down. Oh, come on. Alright, go away, Geodude.
<sighs> Not again. Go away, Geo Dude. I don't want to deal with you. I don't have water gun yet. Therefore, I can't really use it as a training mechanism. Eh. Now, if you have a little flash mechanism, you can actually see a little bit of the cave when you click through menus. It's quite amusing, actually. Scratch. Thank you. I do remember getting to this item before in the dark. It's just not working today. Probably use them on camera. It's gonna fail and make me look like a dummy. Like always. And of course, running into Pokemon every five seconds like it's freaking Unova doesn't help at all either. Ah, there we go. Unova just pretty much means black and white. Yay! Alright. How do I get out of here? <sighs> okay. This is getting agitating. They're about to go away. Thank you. Do I know water gun yet? No. No. Alright, just gonna go up. Go away, Geo Dude. I do not have water gun yet. If I don't have water gun, I can't use you to train. Alright. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna end the episode here and. I'll find my way out of here. The so next time with Pokemon Silver, we'll be going to Violet City. See you then. Meow's blasting off again.